Welcome to the Folktale Project. This is Dan Schultz. Today's story is one of Aesop's fables, and it teaches us about utility. This is the bird catcher, the partridge, and the rooster. A bird catcher received an unexpected visit from a friend just as he was about to dine on a simple meal of herbs and parsley. Since he hadn't actually caught anything lately, the bird cage was empty. So, the man decided to slaughter a speckled partridge that he had tamed to use as a decoy. The partridge begged the bird catcher not to kill him. My dear man, how will you hunt with your net in the future? Who will assemble that flocks of gregarious keen-eyed birds on your behalf, and who will serenade you with singing as you drift off to sleep? The bird-catcher let go of the partridge, and decided to kill the bearded rooster instead. The rooster, however, let out a squawk from his perch, and said, If you kill me, how will you know how much longer it is until dawn, since I am the one who tells you the time? How will you know that Orion, with his golden bow, is on watch during night? Who will remind you of the morning's work, announcing the dew on the bird's outstretched wings? The man thought, and said, It is useful indeed to know what time it is, but all the same, my friend has to have something to eat. And that is the story of the bird catcher, the partridge, and the rooster. And it we see Aesop's beauty in his brevity, but also the power of utility. This is Dan Scholes for the Folktale Project. Don't forget that you can subscribe to the podcast on Apple Podcasts, Stitcher, Google Play, Overcast, anywhere that you like to get your podcasts. You can also follow us on Twitter at Folktale Project. You can find us on Auto Radio, TuneIn Radio, and iHeart Radio. And you can always head over to folktaleproject.com where you'll find a new story waiting for you every weekday morning. Thanks for listening.